Just gonna wait for my friends to get here. Because that's why I'm streaming. No. Just trying to make a beat out of this. All right, we're going to do original, controls, original, subtitles on. All right. And, like, I always want to take the easy route, but I'm going to take the medium route because, like, I have played this a few times. And I always play as Jill because she's my favorite. She is my favorite Resident Evil character. I love her very much. Alpha Team is flying around the forest zone, situated in northwest Raccoon City, where we are searching for the helicopter of our compatriots, Bravo team, who disappeared during the middle of their Chris, mission. Found it yet? No, not yet, Brad. Bizarre murder cases have recently occurred in Raccoon City. There are outlandish reports of families being attacked by a group of about ten people. Victims, Victims were, were apparently eaten. eaten. The Bravo team was sent in to investigate, but we lost contact. Look, Chris. Bravo Team's helicopter was a derelict. Save for the remaining body of Kevin. I'm so sorry, Kevin. We continued our search for the other members, and it turned into a nightmare. <laughs> Joseph. I've been bitten by a dog in the throat, so like, the dogs scare the shit out of me. Brad's like, I'm taking off in the helicopter, bitch. Chris, this way. Damn it. Make for that mansion. 
That looks so far away. I'd be like, you know what? I'm done. Uh, yeah, you can reply in chat. That would be easier. There are only three STARS members left now. Captain Wesker, Barry, and myself. We don't know Oh, I wish I could turn this brightness down a little bit. I will in a second. What is this place? A fucking house. Not quite your ordinary house, that's for sure. Hey, Wesker, where's Chris? Jill, no. You don't want to go back out there. But we've got to find... What was that? Chris? Fireworks. No. Jill, go and investigate. I'm going with her. Chris and I go back a long way. All right. You two go. I'll secure this area. Mm hmm. Stay sharp. Dining room. This is like a dining room that I would build in The Sims in a giant mansion. Let's turn this brightness down just a little bit here. Hello, how do I turn you down? I'm trying to adjust. The fuck? There we go. Jeez. That's the dimmest we can go? Alright. Oh my god. I need to get used to these controls again. Oh my. That's it. I'm playing with the gamepad. I think you'd better take a look at this. What is it? Blood. Jill. See if you can find any other clues. I'll be examining this. Let's just hope it's not Chris's. Like, do you have a DNA test, or... What are you going to do to test this blood? That's what I want to know. Like... Also, I know where certain things are in the game, so, like, I'm just going to grab them. Barry. That's not what I meant to do. But a uh, nice contemplative moment. I forgot that I played with the gamepad in this game and not the controllers. That God, it's so bright. It's the worst. went in for a hug, but, uh, sorry. Six feet, bitch. Thank you. Oh, yeah, I love the door animations. Barry! What is it? Look out! It's a monster! Let me take care of it! Alright, this man has a magnum. And that took three fucking magnum bullets. What the hell is this thing? I found Kenneth killed by this thing. Let's report this to Wesker. Let me just uh, turn around real quick. We'll grab that ink ribbon later. And then that zombie gets up and apparently goes through the fucking door, which they don't even do. Wesker! 
Jill, help me look for him. Let's not leave this hall. Good idea. Oh, Wesker! Where you at, bitch? Not fine instructions. Give me attitude. Barry. Any luck, Jill? No, nothing. What's going on around here? I can't figure it out. Same here. Chris, and now Wesker. There's not much we can do. We can search for him separately. I'll investigate the dining room again. Okay, then. I'll try the door on the other side. <sighs> this mansion is gigantic. We could easily get lost. Let's start from the first floor. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, I almost forgot. It's a lockpick. You'd make better use of it. What, you can't use a fucking lockpick? Thanks. I may need it. Listen. If something happens, let's meet up in this hall. Got it? Okay. Yeah, if I get lost in this giant mansion, I'll just make sure to fucking puzzle my way back to this room. Let's check out this door. I love how that looks like an owl eyeballs. I also love how this is an Aquarius statue. Can we just point that out for a hot second? This voluptuous Aquarius statue? Mm-hmm. Actually, let me just jump over this. No, we're not gonna move it. We're gonna jump over it. Oh my god. Excuse me while I get used to moving in this game. I've been playing things that aren't tank controls. Yeah, I'm gonna take the fucking dagger. Defensive items, blah blah blah. Use them. He's tall. No, nope, let me use that dagger. Excuse me, excuse me. Excuse me, let me just, uh, yeah, yeah, okay. No, I don't want to move that. I just want to jump over it. Thank you. How do I use my knife? Do I not have a knife yet? Okay. No, we're going to do this. Wow. Wow, Darcel. Look at that dagger in his head. There we go. You can tell he's dead because the music stops. Oh my god, get the fuck down. Oh my god. I need to stop trying to use the, uh, wow! Getting used to using the gamepad is hard. Okay, people? Also, let me just, uh, equip my gun real quick. Can see myself forgetting that and trying to kill something and just failing. Oh, a little too far. Really? We're gonna do this? We're gonna do this right now? This particular ass game? Now we can get this shiny. Oh, um, instead of using the stick, I'm using the, like, four directional things on the controller. Because the, uh, the stick will just 
make you reverse your direction, go 180. Whereas the gamepad, it with tank controls, like moving forward, like pressing forward, is always forward. Like your character will always go forward. Or um, if they go, if you press left, it's your character's left. They will always go to their left. And it's just easier if you've got the gamepad instead of trying to do that with the uh, stick, in my opinion. An emblem of a sword is carved onto the lock, into the lock. Let's see if Barry's in here. I wonder if I turn this down on my TV, the brightness, if it will affect how you guys see it. Well, it turned it down for me. Oh my god, I keep pressing the f fucking directional thing. Alright, we don't know where that zombie is, and uh, we don't really care. Oh, shit. This guy, we knew him. Let's let's check his body. Let's let's see what's up. Kenneth, I'm sorry, man. It's the film that belonged to Kenneth. I need a video player to see what's recorded on it. I hear that zombie fucking walking in the hallway behind us. But we're just gonna ignore him. Yes, I will take the handgun magazine. I'm gonna take these herbs too. Looks like there's a dead person over in the corner. These chairs look fucking expensive. Or historical. Or both. Hey. An instant death. <laughs> Thank you. I can't help it. I just, I break out in song. He said to stay downstairs, but like, he disappeared, so I'm gonna do whatever I want. Uh, uh hello, zombie on the floor. Take this herb really quick. Let me just take this herb really quick, okay? All right. We're not gonna say anything about it. It's just on the download between me, you, and me. Did I tell you guys that I want a tattoo on my forearm that says, "Will you take the green herb?" There's a zombie in here. I'm not even gonna play. Get up. Let's do this. There we go. Shiny. Golden arrow. All right. No more bullets. Always love more bullets. Okay. Hey. 
Well, then remove that shit. Arrowhead. All right. Poor man's emerald. You'd think with a mansion like this, it would just be made of fucking emerald. But, you know. Cut costs where you can. Oh, I like to call this a zombie track. Because it's just a big circle. And you can just... Bam, bam. Come on, my man. I know you're not done. Jeez. Took a lot of bullets. <laughs> How dare they? Are we talking about, uh, Steven Universe right now? Cause... Yes, I will take this dagger. Give it to me. I will take literally any dagger you give me. There's a statue over there that I gotta smash, but I'll do that later. I'm just kinda, like, exploring like it's my first time playing, cause I kinda... Just wanna fuck around, you know what I mean? An armor. What I would give to live in a mansion like this. A sword. Remember that. Sword sword key is like the first one, I think. Yeah, it's like a lime green gemstone. It's it's different. Like emerald is a different color than peridot. Peridot? Peridot? I don't know. All right, let's look in here. Looks like there's some something, some bullets, some shotgun shells for when I get the shotgun, which is, uh, my favorite. Yeah, I'm just a police officer checking out, you know, the fact that all of my dead fellow officers are fucked up in this forest and mansion. But yeah, I'll go into this crypt. No big deal. She is the bravest bitch ever. Alright, so we got some masks here. Some, some head things. So they're all missing different shit. We don't need to look at the last one, because it's kind of fucking self-explanatory. We got this coffin hanging from the ceiling from some chains, which is homey. We're obviously going to take this book. I don't know why you'd ever take this book. I feel like if I were in there and I saw this book, I'd be like, this is obviously a fucking trap. We're gonna examine that. Got a key. Yes, I'll remove it. Give me that key. Book of Curses. The four masks. A mask that speaks no evil. A mask that smells no evil. A mask that sees no evil. A mask that cannot speak, smell, or see evil. When all four masks, or oops, <laughs> when all four fall into place, evil will awaken. Which, like, we're down for that. <laughs> so, like, obviously we're going to try to find all four of them, because, like, we need evil to awaken. 
right? Wouldn't you replace it with, like, a rock or something? I mean, you're in a graveyard. Like, pick up a fucking stone. Alright, we got the sword key. There's a door up here that's... But I always go to the first floor door first, so I'm going to do that. Because I'm a methodical bitch. I basically go through the mansion the same exact way I did when I was 10 years old. Okay, wait. First of all. It's going to call it the mansion key until we examine it, and that's going to drive me insane, so. There we go. Yes, let's go through. Come on, come on, come on. I don't want to hang around, but this looks movable. Like I said, give me all the daggers. Not movable. See how that looks right there? See all the detail in the china and everything? And movable one. Looks like this. All faded and bad skinned. Yeah, just let me know when you guys are going to grab one and uh, I'll take like a hot second. I hate this angle, because, like, you cannot see bullshit from here. I don't even remember if I want to go out here yet. Let's just go through the door. Let's just f let's fucking do this. Oh, dogs. Yep, we're gonna we're gonna just <laughs> back right up for a second. We're just gonna go back inside. Yeah, we don't wanna yeah. We don't need to go out there yet, so we're not gonna go out there yet. I love how this is moving like an ocean. Like, almost nice. It's serviced. LOL. Yeah, bitch. And I immediately regret that decision. Squish him. Good job, Jill. <laughs> that voice acting of puking was so bad. All right, uh, I'm going to pause for just a second, take a little bathroom break.
Sorry, I didn't stop into the stream. I am mainly streaming for my friends right now, so. And they're getting some pizza. Which I wholeheartedly endorse. I could honestly go for some pizza right now. Like, extra mushrooms. Man, if anyone watches this stream after I stream it, check out Doc underscore Brown Bear. He plays some cool shit, and uh, he's pretty funny and chill. Love watching him stream. I should have one of those, like, screens where there's, like, a loading screen and a countdown and everything, and it's all cute, and it's like, she'll be back in just a second. But, uh, nah. My cats are, like, trying to get into the basement right now. They just, like, paw the door and, like, slam it over and over again to try to get it to open. I mean, it works if you don't turn the knob right, but it just, they look so stupid when they do it. They're just like, dun, 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 dun. And now Tucker's yelling at me because I'm talking about him. Come here, kitty. Nope, just gonna stare at the basement door. I'm not letting you in there. He just takes shits down there. You can stare at me all you want. I'm not letting you down there. Less nice. Wash your hands. You just put your uh, entire arm into corpse water. I'm gonna walk over to him. I don't know if you guys can hear him meowing, but it's like kind of hilarious. I 
Alright, outside, both of you. Alright, I'm just gonna go a little bit further, because I know there's not anything that happens. All right, we got a room here. It's looking very, uh, very almost like Renaissance and Art Deco had a baby. And that leads into another room. Looks like a game slash cigar room to me. This looks like a, uh, Horse riding crop. Let's take the uh, ink ribbon. Ooh, that's our last spot. That's our last spot. Oh, you can hear him meowing? That's adorable. I'm going to take the shotgun. Yep. Well, shit. Uh... Oh, God. What did I do now? Wesker! Barry! Help! Jill! You in there? Barry? Get me out of here! The door's jammed! Stand back! Grab my hand! <sighs> she wouldn't fucking toast if no one was out there. <clears throat> Barry! <laughs> that was a close one. A second late, you would have fit nicely into a sandwich. Really? Thanks. A but Jill then, sandwich. Going back to the to find other clues? I'm glad and all, but why are you here? I just had something I wanted to check. Mm -hmm. Anyway, we should get back to searching for Wesker and Chris. Thanks, Barry. I owe you one. So in town, splitting up. It. I feel like in this situation, you wouldn't want to split up with like your partners, you know? Personally. Any feet dragon? No, oh, hello. Jesus, that was five shots, bitch. Yeah, take a headshot. Jesus. Call your mother. Something's wrong with your health. Ooh. Lightning. Thunder. Oh, another. Hello. The art of killing zombies off screen. Please tell me you are not going to take. You are. You're going to take more bullets. No, oh, maybe not. 
Oh, there's another one. You got too much shit, Jill. You're too stocked. Alright, now this is what we call a safe room. You can tell because the music is, like, calm. Usually get an item box and a saving thing. Uh, we're not going to need this for a while. Um... Keep the shotgun. Don't necessarily need the knife. I'll keep the herb. Don't need the first aid spray. Special instructions for the disposal of dead bodies. We have new information regarding those beings. They may appear to be dead, but in fact they are able to come back to life. However, they are, there are ways to prevent them from becoming active again. Currently, there are two known methods to cease the resurrection. One, incineration. Two, destruction of the head. If further methods are discovered, you'll be notified immediately. Meanwhile, to those of you who still have the will to live, <laughs> which, like, who the fuck would? Oil has been placed on the first floor of the mansion. Take as much as you need. You'll need something to light it with, which you'll need to find by yourself. Which is, like, this little flask thing they have here. So I'm supposed to burn the bodies. And, uh... I don't do that. I'd rather just, uh... Let them turn into crimson heads and, uh, fuck me up. And that's who I am as a person, so... Fight me. I thought we fucking picked up ink ribbon. Did I put it in here? I did. Alright, I need to remember. I'm gonna do it on six. So I remember which one it is. I play this game quite often. <laughs> Alright, let's get rid of this fucking ink ribbon. We'll take this. And, uh, I'm not sure where we're going next, but... I mean, we'll find out, right? No, I meant to combine that with the... There we go. Let's also... Reload real quick. Alright, now we're good. I think we'll go upstairs. Check out what's up there, because it sounded like there was a Zobni up there. Yep, definitely. Let's grab this. A little extra herb. Got the ground shit and the uh, the leafy shit, you know. Let's try to aim at him from here. No. All right. No. Oh. He must be over in this hallway. Yep. Hi. Come this way. Hello. Man, medium mode, they take a lot of bullets. Alright, this one's unlocked down here. We'll check it out. Ooh, lots of herbs. And we'll be back here eventually, so I'm just gonna leave those two there. 
I like this room though. It's a cozy ass room. It looks nice. Emblem of a helmet. I don't remember which one you get first, helmet or armor. Mm hmm. I think maybe armor. Nice. Good job, Jill. Unlock the shit out of those doors. The master of unlocking. Oh, what do we have here? And we also don't have any room for the lighter that I'm going to need, so we need to just store this immediately. Or store the herbs. I love how she just plows through these dead bodies that are on the floor. Oh, and I mention this every time I stream this game, but if you look on the floor, there are like 20 fucking throw rugs. Why would you not just get a carpet? I do not understand that. Like, are you trying to show off your wealth? I'm not quite sure. Like, here we go. Look. Look. Look at all these fucking... Look at these rugs. Why? It makes no sense. Oh, this is a nice room of Victrola. <laughs> Didn't even think of that. Oh, crumpled memo. Today, Sir Spencer told me to hide something where no one could find it. Well, I had this idea. I figured if I could somehow have it protected by a dangerous animal, like the vicious canine that lives here, no one would be able to get near it. As far as I can tell, the mutt is always hanging around the second floor balcony on the west side of the terrace, and he ought to come running at the sound of a dog whistle. This is where you come in. The thing is, I reckon you're the only person that can get near that damn dog without risking a serious mauling. Which means only you can put this collar on him. The object that Sir Spencer wants hidden is concealed inside. You're the only person I can trust with this. Of course, you'll get something out of it as well. Remember that certain item you've always wanted to get a hold of? Well, in exchange for your services, I just might able uh, just might be able to get it for you. This could work out well for the both of us. John Tolman. And like, I know that I need to pick up other shit in this room, it just the inventory shit drives me nuts. This just tells you how to use the herbs, which, like, I know how to do. You know what? You know what? I've played this before, so I'm just gonna eat my herb. Yep, that's all three fucking herbs. Don't even care. Don't, no, I don't care about the journal. I want the lighter. I want the lighter. Excuse me, game. Excuse me, game. Thank you. I just ate three fucking herbs for this lighter. Give it to me. No. Oh, okay. Hmm. Where to go now?
dog whistle. What terrace do we need to go to? Second floor balcony on the west side of the terrace. Second floor balcony. All right. I don't think we've gotten to the second floor balcony. Hmm. Hmm. class. Alright, finally. Barry. Jill. Got any good news? Other than I'm still alive in this madhouse? No. Can't say it's much safer here either. We'd better secure our escape route first. There's gotta be a back door somewhere. All right then, let's split up again. See you later. Ciao. Yeah, let's just split up continuously. I think one of these doors, was it that door that was the sword key? I feel like one of these. It was that one. Damn it. Second floor balcony. Give me one second. I am just going to grab another soda. All right. Balcony. Like, I've been to the balcony, or not balcony, but like outside area with the dogs on the first floor. It doesn't look like there's anywhere else I can go here. That's locked. That's locked.
Oh, I forgot this. The doorknob looks like it's ready to fall apart. Go through anyway? Yes. Like, is that my dagger? Nice. Of course, an emblem of an armor. I really don't think there's anything for me out here, but I'm going to check anyway. Nope. Just dogs. Second floor balcony. Damn it, dog. What to do, what to do? Oh. I know what I need to do. Hmm. The unlit fireplace. My sense of direction is not the best. Hang in there with me. Right? Is that where I'm going? For a game that relies heavily on a map like this and not having any sense of direction, yes, I do realize how funny that is. But, uh, you know, this is how I say sharp. And by sharp, I mean functional. We gotta get to, uh, the room with the fireplace. Wouldn't you just stay here? Like, if this zombie shit was happening, there's, like, liquor and shit. I don't know, man. Yeah, 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 yeah.
That is actually mighty helpful. Right? There's like a blanket and books. You could be set. Do we have room for these herbs? Not really. Let's get rid of this lighter. One second. So we've got the second floor map. Mm. Looking for some gray doors. <sighs> Not seeing a whole lot of them. What's next? Let's try... I have an idea. I have an idea. We're gonna run into a Zobni, but I have an idea. You dead? No. Of course you aren't. Of course you aren't. This is medium mode. Alright. If you see a pool of blood, that means they're dead. Um. Not seeing it? Oh, wait, yep. I see it. Success. Yes, let's just go even further into creepy land. This music isn't fucking settling, I'll tell you that right now. Mmm! Any bullets? No, just fucking maggots. Nice. Let's go over here. Oh. My man, I'm sorry. I don't know what happened. Okay, no power. There's a door over here, I'm pretty sure. Oh, nice.
Why do you always have to fall? Excuse me, I'm gonna run away. Jesus! Take a fucking bullet or two, I guess. Are you done? No! He's not even done! Jesus! Seriously, take all my bullets, why don't you? You dickhead. I didn't even get anything from here. Like, I have no idea where to go from here. Like, I didn't even get a key. I didn't get shit. Stairwell in the west of the mansion. Okay. 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 I can do that. Getting better at moving. Maybe. Excuse me, crows. Didn't know this was your, uh, domain. Ah, yes. This place is a goddamn labyrinth. No, no. I thought I knew where I was going and I did not. I need to get into this door. Yes. Discard. I still got my, uh... Alright, got the dog whistle. Got the dog whistle. There's a zombie in here, but I'm just gonna... Peace out real quick. And you know I'm not even fucking around with these dogs. Yes, I will take the collar. That's a gorgeous window. Yes, discard. Where are you, though? Oh, okay. That one guy trying to get into the club. Yes! Headshot! Oh, another one, huh? You at? Are you in here? No? Where are you?
bullshit. There's nothing unusual. Hmm, I know where you go. Let me just map this real quick. Uh, all right, it's second floor. I know that. No, not what I wanted. I need to get into the hall that is legit right there. Oh, hi! Jesus. Oh boy! Oh no! Hey, hey, hey! Let me just reload this really, really. I can't reload. I can't reload right now. Are oh, excuse me? Uh. Mhm. Mm Are you gonna get up again? Just one, all right. Jesus. The way they get up scares the shit out of me. But now I have the armor key. Whoa, wrong way. Oh, and he's gone. That's fucking settling. Where the fuck is he? Oh, Jesus. Another one. You can't reload when you're close to like when you're like in combat or something. I am running out of bullets though. This is going to become a problem. Um. Hmm. Well, I have the armor key, so let's just explore some doors. I will BRB after this door. I need to. Take a quick bathroom break. Looks like this guy's gotten up too.
Alright, I'm back. And I believe we have a crimson head on our hands. Yep, zombie track. Ah, oh, damn you! Fuck my health up? Okay, good. You getting up again? We doing this one more time? Alright. Oh boy. Let's go fucking unlock some doors. Not that one. We're not going to unlock that one. There we go. Let me just do this one thing and examine the armor key so that it says armor key. I didn't mean to combine. There we go. Man, bullets are running low. Ooh, bullets. Yes. Feed me the bullets. Another fucked up partner. And he looks really fucked up, too. Uh, excuse me. That sounds like a crimson head. Three of my bullets. It just, it makes me upset, you know? But. Uh, we're definitely gonna eat that one fucking herb then. Because <laughs> we're gonna get this launcher. Camera angles, camera angles. We need to find the item box. Put some shit away. I believe there's one this way. Wow. Yes, right into the wall.
Please don't be crimson heads. Please don't be crimson heads. Alright. Oh shit, we got some stuff in here too. Alright, we're gonna put the lighter away. Um we can combine these two. Let's save. Pick this shit up. Nope, that's not what I wanted. Picking up this shit. Take the fire rounds. Some people organize the shit out of their inventory. I am not that person. So if that's what you're here for, it's it's just not gonna happen, so more armor doors. I don't want to go through that first floor door again because it uh, gives you three tries and then you're done. Oh, I think the fiance might be home. Let's do it. Let's get into this fucking story. Richard! What happened? You're wounded! This whole place is a killing zone. There are monsters. What did this to you? A big snake, and it had to be poisonous. Poisonous? Richard, hold on. Bring me serum. I saw some, but didn't bring any. I'll go and get it, okay? You're gonna make it. Thanks. Serum time. No, why, what's up? Oh, I'm sorry, baby. Oh, thank you. What'd you get me? Oh my god, yes! Sour candy. I think I'm going the right way. Yes. Oh, yes, that's good stuff. Thanks, babe. I didn't... Oh, we need new conditioner. I did not know. Oh, 
Oh, Lauren says hi. Yeah, he got me sour candies. Oh, no. Oh, no. This is not the way I was supposed to go. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Let me go back out. We can get there from the main entrance or the main hall. Yeah. <laughs> this guy's gonna be fucking dead by the time I get the serum. Sorry, Richard. Pretty sure we're going the right way. Yes. I think. Maybe. Oh my god, where am I going? How the fuck do I get to that staircase? No, I need to go back up. By the way, y'all should never road trip with me. It's the worst. Well, I hear some zombies trying to get in. Just gonna ignore that. Yup. Nice door opening. Yup. Do not fucking care. Getting some serum. I think I'll be fine. God, I hope I'll be fine. Where are they even coming from? Go to here. All right, go to the second floor. Right? That's where the snake is, right? I'm pretty sure.
Richard! What do you mean it's not necessary to use this right now? The man is dying. We'll uh hang out with this. Stop. Why? I thought we were supposed to give him the serum. What the fuck happened? What the fuck? I am so pissed. I always save him. He's fucking dead. Ugh. Die, bitch. You know what? I don't have any in the clip, but I got one in this. Oh, I'm so angry. Oh, there was a zombie in there. Oh, there is. Hi. How are you? Yep, eat me. That's fine. You're a dick. Jesus, how many bullets are you going to take? Oh, I need to go get my lighter. Are you serious? Enough. Now one right here. That sounds like a headshot to me. A <sighs> shield, all right. Need to get my lighter. I think I might quit after I get to the safe room. Hi. Round two. Not believe Richard died. I feel like such a failure. I don't think that guy's coming back. All right. Oh, nice. Yeah, I'm just gonna find the save room and then I'm good. Oh, I'm glad. I'm glad you guys like it. It picks up a bit more. Like, you start to, like, find shit in the house from, like, diaries of employees that have worked here and shit. And it gets, like, it gets really deep. That's not where I meant to go.
Are you serious? Did you just... Did you just... No. Mm -hmm. I have one more ink ribbon. Well, I know there's some in the dining room, but... Let's save... Nope. Not what I wanted to do, but now we're number seven. <laughs> Thank you for tuning in. I'm going to head out. Bye, Lawrence. Bye, Lawrence.